My story began in April 2010 when I heard an advertising campaign on the local radio, um, advertising for ladies between the age of 40 and 49 to go to Action Cancer for mammogram. I thought I would do this because I had two cousins who were suffering from breast cancer, so I phoned up, made an appointment, and I'm very lucky that I did because uh, they discovered a lump. Um, I was then seen at the hospital the very same day and had a needle biopsy done and it did reveal that I did have breast cancer. I then had to wait about uh, 10 days then uh, before I had the operation and I had the surgery to remove the, the tumour and some lymph nodes. You then have a wait of about another 10 days for the results and uh, when the results came back it was very good. They had removed all of the tumour and the cancer hadn't spread to my lymph nodes. I was very shocked indeed when I discovered I had breast cancer because up to then I had no idea. If I hadn't have gone for the mammogram, I never would have known that I had breast cancer and it would have gone undetected. So at the time, to find out just in an evening that you have breast cancer, it's very, de very devastating news to have to go home and tell your family. My daughter Lauren, my eldest daughter, um, was very visibly upset, um, but she seemed to deal with the news better. Uh, my youngest daughter Holly was very quiet and very withdrawn and she was the one that actually worried me more. And my husband Martin was devastated. We were very determined that we were going to pull together and fight this. Sadly in the September, um, the September 2010, I got the sad news that uh, one of my cousins, she's also called Joanne, um, she um, was terminally ill with her breast cancer and uh, she died within the week. It was very fast and le left me very shaken. So once again, I turned to Action Cancer and uh, they offered me counselling services and complementary therapy. So now I am a year and a half after a diagnosis and um, I'm actually trying to be very involved with Action Cancer and I would try and encourage all females between the age of 40 and 49 and over 70 to go for a mammogram. It only takes a few moments of your time uh, it's not uncomfortable and uh, early detection definitely saves lives, it definitely saved mine.